everybody, and welcome back to the quarry. Just because I don't remember exactly what happened in the last episode. Hey, stop. Stop oh. squirming. I don't remember what happened. Give me the truth. Is she hit? Huh? Is she hit? I'm not supposed to know. I don't know. I mean, look at her. Nah. Get the fuck away from me! Oh! oh. He so thoroughly looked her over. Is she bit? No. I don't remember what I did in my last recording, because I think this is back a little bit. Caitlin! Ryan! Abby! Oh, no, no. I think this is where we ended. It doesn't feel safe. It does not. We're gonna run into Nick. Well, Nick's not really Nick anymore, I guess. And Ryan? I'm still caught up between werewolf and vampire. I honestly could believe either. not work. Honestly, it's probably safe, though. It's full moon. Werewolf called it. Well, they also made hints like it's a dog. Jesus. I oh, yeah, killed it. I mean... Dead people don't usually jump out of windows and run into the forest. Yeah, point. Abby, he was gonna hurt you. You were defending yourself. I, I don't... I don't know that for sure. I do. No. It was you or him. And, well, that definitely wasn't him. Man, this is so funny. crazy woman with a gun killing people. I'm not killing people. Holy shit, you... Laura Kearney? You're Laura Kearney? Yes? You were supposed to be working, uh, helping out in the nurse's office, right? And you never showed up? Huh? You and the guy, what's his name? Max? Yes, Max. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Mr. Hackett said that you had changed your mind last minute. I, I think that we should, I think that we should listen to her. I don't trust this either, but... Okay. I'm gonna open the door. Slowly. Just keep your hands up, okay? Okay. This could be a good thing. This could be a good thing. Here we are again. Yes, yes. Just... You? Me. Way to make that weird, but yep. Why don't we take another look at what you've found? Did you look hard enough? I'm These cards I'm aren't sorry. just trinkets. You should know this by now. They they can help you. I can help you. Off you go then. Top top. One down, remember. It's not terribly exciting. So, uh, why didn't you come? Where have you been for the past two months? 
We did come. One night early. That was our mistake. I feel like we should not actually. No, no we're gonna leave it be. <laughs> what? Did we go back in time? Did I miss something? Did I blink in something? Did we go back in time? Yeah, I think I, I think we went back in time. Oh my god. This is an interrogation. I ask, you answer. Oh. Name. What? It's not. Laura Kearney. Who are you traveling with? And what is your relationship? Max Brindley, he's my boyfriend. Where were you headed last night? To Hackett's Quarry Summer Camp. You already know this. What have you done with Max? No. I ask, you answer. That's how this works. Let's, let's just leave it. Fine. I don't think arguing's gonna do much. What do you want to know? Oh. Well. Uh. Why were we going to Hackett's Quarry last night? Max and I are camp counselors. Oh, bullshit. Counselors aren't due until today. I told you, we drove up and got there early. We figured we'd just go to camp. Why didn't you go to the motel like I told you? Because we were, like, way closer to the camp, and we're broke. Mm. Okay, Sheriff. Hackett. Is it Hackett too? Wait, Hackett? Like, Chris Hackett? Don't change the subject. What the fuck is going on here, man? <laughs> you have no idea what's going on here. No. Not a goddamn clue. You just stepped in some grade A double prime, go ahead and kill yourself cosmic type shit, young lady. And your only option is to no. buckle the fuck up and do what I say. Do you understand? trying to intimidate me and tell me what the fuck is going on. Is, is Max alive? I 
feel like I'm going crazy. What? I'm just like that, we're free. Huh? No. No, 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 no. Let's go. Hey. Is that Max? Hey, you! Asshole! What tell us what the fuck's going on? Max! I know you hear me! Fuck! I didn't even just say blood spray. What's going on? Okay? Yeah. I mean, I'm... I'm kind of all mixed up, but... More or less intact, I think. I don't huh? know. Yeah. Why am I naked? What? I mean, after we got attacked... The next thing I know, I'm waking up in a jail cell and you're gone. And now you're back again, and, and, and I'm super naked, and there's blood and stuff everywhere. Whoa. I mean, what the fuck happened? Yeah, so our host was very keen on getting me to confess, but I honestly couldn't tell you what I was meant to be owning up to. Jesus. What he used to try to get you to talk? The pincher, the blade? Three hole punch? No, it, he wasn't torturing me. Who does this guy think he is? The sheriff of North Kill, apparently. North Kill? Yeah. Max! What? Did you even look at the map? Hackett's Quarry in North Kill, that's the town. Oh. And it gets better. I gotta look at his name badge and. No! Get dressed. What's he giving you? I'm not gonna be the guest of honor at Fashion Week, I'll tell you that much. Hey! Did I say you could talk to each other? I wasn't aware we needed your permission, Detective Dick Whippet. <laughs> yeah, it's a free country, Officer Oat. For brains. You can't really have them not talk to each other. Alright, buddy. Hands through the bars. Come on. Jesus. Your turn. Let's go. I'm not going anywhere. We can talk right here. Come on. Hey! Hey! Let's Get go. the fuck off! Come on! Move! Good boy. Hey! Stop struggling! Max, calm down. You're only making it worse. Laura. What the hell did you do? Shut up. I'm sorry, you're gonna have me walk around in the jail cell? What's that right here? Ooh, fake brick. Let's make that face. Not a chance. I need some sort of lever. 
Did you say lever? down 5,000 to go what does that do am I supposed to beat him with the brick It, man, I bruise easily. Give me a break. Hey, the second we get out of here, you're toast, motherfucker. Sure. The second you get out. The fuck is that supposed to mean? Okay? It's just a foot. It'll heal. I meant the interrogation. Oh. Yeah. Can't break old Max. Many have tried, many have failed. I'm being serious, Max. He, uh. He just asked a lot of questions. A lot of weirdly specific questions about us and where we we're going and why and how I was feeling this morning and I don't know nothing I said made him seem any less annoyed he asked how you were feeling yeah why he didn't ask you no huh rude Did you get a look at his name badge? You mean it's not really Detective Dick Whippet? It's Hackett. Sheriff Hackett. You think he's related to Chris Hackett? Oh my god, like THE Chris Hackett? Yeah. Who's THE Chris Hackett? As in camp leader Mr. Hackett of Hackett's Quarry, remember? Last night feels like a lifetime ago. The fuck does that mean, though? You know? Where we set up? Maybe it's some... kind of crazy camp counselor kidnapping ring. That's... I mean... What? Well, I guess Sheriff Hackett's not exactly acting like a typical kidnapper, but he's not acting like a typical cop, either. Well, how do you know how kidnappers act? I'm just trying to get us out of here, and I can't get us out of here until I have some clue of why the fuck we're in here. I don't know. What if we can't make sense of it? What? Well, we have to. Sometimes things just don't make sense. What then? We're just stuck in a backwater jail cell for the rest of our lives? You 
Stop. Come on, lighten up. Yeah, easy for you to say. What? Can't you ever accept what's happening? Sometimes shit is just shit. And not everything's some challenge for you to overcome. Uh, actually, yeah, it is. We're gonna get out of here. I'm gonna study to be a vet, and you're... gonna... Um... That's why. pretty depressing. I'm gonna what? I saw the letter, Max. Oh, no. What are you talking about? The rejection letter for college. I found it in your bag. You were poking around in my stuff? I can't believe you didn't tell me. I, I was embarrassed. Wait, your grades were good and you wrote a great essay? Yeah, apparently not good enough. Fuck! You've been making plans, Max. What the fuck? I don't know. What do you want me to say? I'm sorry, Max. This, this really sucks. Hey, it's not the worst thing to happen this summer. I'm sorry. I swore he got ripped apart. I shouldn't have kept it from you. You know you can talk to me about anything, right? Yeah. Yeah, I do. Okay, let's just focus on getting out of here for now. Great. Sign me up. We need to go over it from the beginning. Like from when we left home? Like from when we ran into the cop. So after we ran into the... Whatever we ran into? Yeah. Actually, yeah, that's when shit started getting weird. The dude acted super weird when we said we almost hit an animal. You remember that? It was like he already knew or something. Yeah. Yeah, that was really sketchy. What if he's not even a real cop? Well, he's gotta be dirty, but... I mean, I think he's a real cop. We're in a police station. I mean, yeah, but there's like... Nobody else around. Yeah, that is concerning. Especially the whole hack and hack it thing. Let's just go with the idea that they're both in on it. Okay. So we're supposed to meet Chris Hackett at the camp, and instead, there's nobody there, and we get attacked by something, and then the cop shows up. That part's all fuzzy for me. Like, I remember the steps and. A smell like wet fur and a a dog collar with the name Ian on it. Ian? Ian. I don't think it was a dog Ooh. that attacked us. Whatever it was was big. Like person sized big. Yeah, it really did a number on you. Like I'm surprised you're not more messed up. Like like, like I vividly remember the thing's teeth ripping into you. What is messed up about that is Laura, I don't have a scratch on me. What? Hey, okay, so weird question. Do you remember before we got lost? You got lost? Well, yeah, but before that, I was all like, whoa, look at the moon. It's so big, so cool to see a full moon in the middle of the woods, and you were all like, yeah, no shit, Max, it happens once a month? Yeah, so? Right, so, you know, full moon. Yeah. What if... Uh... Okay. No. Stop. I'm just saying, you know, maybe there's a slight chance it was a werewolf. Are you out of your... Goddamn mine? What? Werewolves? What just happened? Seriously? What the fuck? What? What? what what's so funny? No, it's a werewolf. I, I was right. The exact same Sorry. thing. Okay. Do you, you got anything better? I mean, like... Zombies, aliens, time hopping Draculas. I am hopping. Wow. Ryan, right? Yeah. You want answers? I've got answers. Interrupt me again, you're on your own. Whatever. 
Would it really be so crazy? With all the shit that we've been seeing with Nick? With the thing on the roof? Okay, it would really start to explain a lot of stuff. Dylan. I'm just trying to keep an open mind, okay? This is like your ghost stories. How is this so different from your ghost those, stories? Those are, those are just campfire stories. Like, there has to be a rational explanation for everything, for all of this. Wait, okay, okay. you were not talking so rational when you separated my hand from the rest of my body. You told me to. And if it's bite with which you're faced, cleave limb from torso with great haste. What? You did the right thing. See? She's got a whole poem about it. <laughs> Stupid. There's more to all this than you think. Just let me finish. You can decide for yourself if you believe me or not. I don't care. But I think you should hear all of it. Mm. The next few weeks were long. The cop kept us fed and let us take showers, but aside from that, we barely saw him. Max and I, we talked a lot, as much as we could about what happened that night. It was like trading conspiracy theories. We talked about the cop, the camp, the accident, the woods, the thing in the basement, what happened to Max. We just kept going over it all again and again, and nothing was making sense. All we knew is that we needed to get out of there. Wait, what's camera for? I don't know. How long were they there? I can't take this anymore. Oh, yep. Yeah. It's not that bad. We're probably in the same crap at camp. No, I can't take being in here anymore. Oh. Yeah, well, that part's pretty tough. We've got to do something. We've got to get out of here. We need a, p a plan. We keep saying that. But it's been weeks, so <laughs> weeks? You know, let me know if Jesus. you have one. That's really not very helpful, Max. You are forgetting something. What? Just the ETBT tiny detail that I may or may not be a fucking werewolf, you Laura. Sh sh keep it down. So what? What can we do, really? We run off into the sunset only to be stopped when I turn into a nasty ass monster and kill you and eat you, and then I run off alone into the sunset with little bits of you stuck in my teeth? Okay, okay, stop. Just one problem at a time. All right, we, we don't even know if that's what's really going on, and we won't until we get the hell out of here. Okay. Well, it seems to me that we only have two real options. We can play nice and try to get this guy on our side. What, so he'll let us go? Or we try to catch him off guard and make our escape. Okay, so let's say we get on his good side. What then? Brunch in mimosas every Sunday till he sees the error of his ways? Yeah, I was being rhetorical. The dude doesn't have a good side to get on. I mean, he don't even talk to us half the time. I don't know, I think we could crack him. Laura, I think he's just biding his time until he can figure out a way to get rid of us. That, that's more likely, huh? Permanently. You have a choice. I think we should try. I mean, if he was gonna kill us, we'd be dead by now. So what's he waiting for? Look, we just... If this doesn't work... We try to escape. Deal? Yeah. Deal. So, all right, how are we supposed to get this guy to like us if he won't even talk to us? I don't know. I mean, he's got to have a weak spot, like something we can use. It's not like we don't have time to figure it out. Yeah. Okay. Hey, hey! T-Money! Can I call you T-Money? Why? You can call me Officer Hackett. Hackett? Like as in Hackett's quarry? 
What's it to you? Just interested is all. Feel like we hardly know you. Well, let's keep it that way, okay? Oh, come on, team money, lighten up, man. No reason we can't be buds, right? I can think of seven. You're right. We've been just awful, and we really want to make it up to you. Oh. I, think I see what you're doing. Well, it's not gonna work. You think we're just gonna be besties, and I'm gonna let you walk right out of here. Not gonna happen. Asshole! Max! Max, no! We know what's going on! We know Max is a werewolf! Ooh. Full moon's in a few days, right? What, what then? No, ma'am. You don't know the half of it. Well, she knew enough to get him triggered by something. I said, take your fucking clothes off! Fuck Whoa, off! Get back! Max, what's going on? <laughs> get the fuck away from him! Got an infected look. Come here. Get off of me! Shut up. Have a seat. Ah! Quit squirming. Said you want to be a vet, right? Oh, it's an internship. Let me go! You're not gonna believe it until you see it for yourself. Ask next time, then, dude. Jeez. Don't get too close. Okay. Come in. What's your position? Over. Shit. Mm-hmm. Just wrapping things up here. We won't do that. We won't do that. Down to 20. Over. What's gonna happen? Well, I'll tell you, it's not going to be pretty. But don't worry, I'll be back at dawn. You're really going to leave me here? You'll be fine. Just don't get too close. Max, tell me exactly what you're feeling. Laura, I... I don't feel so good. Not good like how? I don't know, just... Bad. Come closer, let me see your eyes. I think I better stay back. Max, I need to observe you. Is this fucking close enough for you, bitch? He does the whole blood ripping. Oh my god, that's what happened to her eye. Wait, how did she... She break the handcuff.
Please. Fuck! <laughs> it's a rather calm reaction to that, I imagine. Why is that open? Let's see what that bastard cop's hiding. That's her cell. Why would he huh? We're actually gonna go ahead and leave this episode here. So if you like that content, go ahead and hit that like button down below. If you wanna see more like it, go ahead and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next episode. Bye! -bye.